we have a current Blue Jersey holder and a former Blue Jersey winner. People may be wondering, it's probably me, but it's not me. It was Nieve back in. Ah, uh, you. Uh, big day yesterday. Big day. I was looking after myself to climb a little gruppetto and then neck minute. Two teammates up the front, one and two. Historical. One always before the start. Because you lined in the, in the bus like maybe 40 minutes, 50, so you start going a little bit down. So you need a little bit of caffeine for awake again and start to rip it. It's special actually. Really good day yesterday and looking for what for today. How, how will be? Yeah. Every day is a good day. Oh, okay. Today will be another no section for this. There's a spy shot floating around of me being a giant kangaroo with a little Esteban tucked down in my pouch, keeping him nice and safe and warm in there. If you're lost, you can look and you will find me. Time after time. If you fall, I will catch you. I'll be waiting. Time after time. Faino, there's been uh, quite a few questions for you, but we believe the most important one is Timmy H, Timmy H is all Starbucks. Out of all those questions, that's the one you chose. <laughs> for the love, I have to say Tim Hortons, of course. It's a simple, simple answer. I haven't been there for ages, so I'm probably like everyone else who doesn't really know, but I would say, you know, 12 Timbits and uh, a coffee, just a straight coffee. Swaino, what's your go-to food when you get back to Canada? That's a pretty easy one for me. Wild sockeye salmon. It's pretty hard to find over here in Europe. A lot of farm stuff, so yeah, that'd be the first thing. Big old slab of sockeye salmon. The arrow helmet's getting cracked, is it? Well, I'm thinking about it, yeah. One of those days, I reckon. Flat. Probably have to ride in front at some point, I guess, since we got the leader. No expense here, though. I'm old school. I'll never, wear, I'll never wear it. It is, it is a uh, great day yesterday, but uh, back to the grindstone. Uh, today is the day for the sprinters, and just our role is just to keep the guys out of trouble. Uh, obviously, the phases here are pretty simple today, uh, until the break goes. Obviously, you now one thing, and I know the mentality of this team never changes, but just because we've got the Mali Rosa, don't change who you, how you guys have been reacting. Don't treat anyone any different. The way you guys treat people with respect, keep that. Just because we're leading the race doesn't change how we act in the bunch. But how we want to run the final is we're going to use Svano and Chris. We'll have we'll pick one side of the road and we'll burn you guys up through before the tunnel and through the tunnels, okay? So your job is to get those guys as close to From near 10 to 5. 10 to 5. The closest I've, I'll ever get to leading the Giro feels special. Gents, another day in yep. the pink. Yep. yep. Good job, mate. Good job. Around the world, around the world, around the world, around the world, around the world. Yeah. Oh, those finishes, those sponge finishes are always. They're kind of fun, but they're sort of not as well. But we were safe, pretty easy day until the last 5k and well, actually last 20k, and it was full gas and sketchy final, but. Safe and sound in the mountains this weekend. Yeah, but the final was super intense, but the guys are unbelievable, like always. Look after JC, look after me. Really sketchy with the tunnels, but we we can take another stage. And now it's time for it pasta and have a massage. The pride of Denmark, you're neglecting your Wait Irish, your Irish roots. Yeah, I'm just waiting for RT to trump up and ask for an interview. Top of the day there. Go on, good morning, how are you? It's a good stage in the pink, but uh, final, final uh, last 10k neck minute, going through a tunnel, 80k an hour, pitch darkness. A lot can happen in the Euro. Yeah, that's a wrap, stage seven, a rather uneventful day in the Giro, which I'm quite thankful for. Uh, yeah, straight up the coast, and uh, we just had to keep our, our GC guys uh, safe and sound. Uh, couple of sketchy tunnels in the final there where we got through safely and uh, yeah tomorrow oh, we've got a big weekend coming up with uh, with the two hilltop finishes and uh, see what happens. Just about we had a couple of pitch black tunnels there in the final just to spice things up Giro style. No it's okay we uh, got through safely. 
fairly relaxed day before uh, the weekend here now, so uh, no, we'll see how tomorrow goes. That shoe is going to be on the way, is it? Yeah, we'll see about that one. We'll see how not. Neck minute. It about seven years ago in New Zealand, Chris has just got it now. Neck minute. Neck minute, Chris figures it out. What's that? How many jerseys did you get in one boss? What's it? Is the black hole taking another victim down? Yeah, me scissors. Oh, the black hole. Are you going to have to go in? Yeah. Uh, I won't be able to get down there. No worries. Hey, these guys, they are really mean guys. Be careful, be careful. You alright? Yeah, yeah. Be okay. careful, do the black hole. Smile! Smile, Dan? No. Why? Dan, give us a smile. Cost me here.